welcome back to your maths class last week we learned about the five digit numbers that is units tens hundreds thousand and ten thousand yes we learned about the five digit numbers and the place value of the five digit numbers now today we will learn about the expanded form now first thing what is the meaning of expanded form expanded form means to stretch now for example the elastic you know the rubber when we leave it it is in the normal place and when we stretch it it becomes it extends for example now can you see this number read this number what is this number now if you read single single 27859 but when you read the whole number it is 27859 now this is a number now we will expand this number how we will expand this number we have to elaborate it elastic like a elastic stretch it like a elastic now see can you see okay now can you see the numbers over here Now read and tell me what is the numbers. You all read. Now I'll read for you. Okay. Now here we have the numbers which we have expanded. Means we have stretched it. Now here we have two zero 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 zero. Yes. Then we have seven zero zero zero. Then we have eight zero zero. Then we have five zero and nine. That means here two one. After two, how many zeros are there? One, two, three, four. So in all, this is five digit number. That means ten thousand. Yes. So twenty thousand plus seven zero zero zero. How many digits are there? One, two, three, four. That is thousand. So this is seven thousand. Then here, which is the next number? Eight. After eight, how many zeros are there? One, two. Again, eight zero zero. After eight, two zeros means in all one, two, three. Three digits number. That is hundreds place. The value of eight is in hundreds place. After that, we have five and zero. Now the value of five is in the tens place because two digit numbers we have. Now single number nine. So the value of nine it is in the units place. So now we know the value of these numbers. So in all, when we add it like this, yes, then we get the whole number once again. We will bring the numbers back to its original place. Yes, like this. Third number. 
number that means the value of 4 is a hundreds place units tens and hundred so we will write here okay over here 4 after 4 how many numbers are there 1 2 so 0 0 yes then after this 4 which number is there 5 so 1 2 that is in the second the value of that it is in the second place that means it is in the tens place so we will write here 5 after 5 how many numbers are there only 1 so 1 0 will come now we will bring this number which number is this 0 yes so after that any number is there no so we will bring this 0 over here now we have to add all this yes and see what answer we get now here 0 
because this is a last number because single number means the units place yes so units tens hundreds thousand and ten thousand so the value of this numbers when we stretch it out that means we have expanded the number here ninety thousand plus five thousand plus two hundred plus eighty plus three this is called the expanded form now one more example i will give you if suppose zero is there in between okay we'll just change this numbers yes if suppose here zero is there like this the number is okay ninety six thousand and eighty one so how you will expand this type of sum if zero is in between yes anywhere it can be it can be in the second place third fourth or over here in the fifth place anyway so how you will expand that now here we will start again first copy down nine now we will expand it okay after nine how many numbers are there one two three four okay so we will add here four zero we will put here four zero then put a plus sign after nine which number is there six we will write down six after six again we will count how many numbers are there after six one two three so we will write here three zeros after that again we will put a plus sign now after that which number is there zero now zero is that that doesn't mean we will leave that zero that zero is also having a value because here if you come from behind 1 2 3 the zero is there in the hundreds place yes the zero is there in the hundreds place so either we can put here this zero first we will copy after that you can put one two zeros behind it or you can just leave this zero as zero and we can put a plus sign both ways are there either just bring that zero down then put a plus sign or we can put this because this is in the the value of this zero is in the hundreds place so we brought that zero down and after that one two zeros we have added now after that which number is there eight after it how many numbers a single number so a single zero will come here again put a plus sign one after one any number is there no so just leave it as it is now when we add it 90,000 plus 6,000 plus 0 plus 80 plus 1. You get the answer 96,081. So, this is called the expanded form. That means we are finding the place value of that number by expanding that number. So, for today, I hope so you all have understood it expanded form uh, yes okay children so we will practice on this sums today thank you